I'm gonna use every MLB The Show cover athlete, starting with Jazz Chisholm. Every cover athlete will have to complete a challenge in this video, and for Jazz, all he has to do is get on base. This should be pretty doable. Jazz? Is it gonna go? Jazz Chisholm, yeah. That's getting on base. And just like that, that's one challenge down. So I'm happy we started off with a pretty easy challenge because I'm only gonna get three attempts to complete each challenge in this video. And for every challenge I fail, I will be giving away a copy of MLB The Show 23. So our next cover athlete is Shohei Otani. Let's see what Shohei Otani's challenge is gonna be here. We have hit a triple. Oh, this one's gonna suck. Don't catch it. Don't catch it. I'm already down 0-2 in this at-bat. No, I really just struck out on a changeup. I mean, attempt number two can't be any worse than number one, can it? This is already looking like an L. Third time's the charm. I mean, if that gets by him... Oh, it was close! It was close. Yeah, that's not gonna be a triple, which means we have one copy of MLB The Show to give away so far. Now I am gonna do these giveaways on my Instagram and my Twitter. At the end of the video, I'll tally up how many giveaways we have to do and I'll divide it between those two platforms. So make sure you're following both for a better chance to win. But wait, there's more. There's a total of 14 cover athletes we're gonna use today because unfortunately we do have some cover athletes that aren't in the game. But if I fail more than six of these challenges, I will be giving away an additional five copies of MLB 23. So there's a lot on the line for me today. Our next cover athlete to use will be Fernando Tatis Jr. Let's see what I'm gonna have to do here with Fernando Tatis Jr. We have to hit a double. The thing about this one is that this could be either really easy or really difficult. Let's go, Fernando, right here. Of course. Of course I hit a tank. That doesn't count. It has to be a double. There is a slot on the wheel for hitting an extra base hit. If I got that one, that swing would have counted, but I need specifically a double. I don't want to say you have to get lucky for this challenge because you still have to hit the ball well, but it's like you can't hit it too well. Are we, are we for real right now? I have two homers with Fernando. This dude is really two for two with two tanks and is failing. Don't, don't leave the yard. Don't leave the yard. Don't leave the yard. Yes, double for Tatis. We secured it at the end and that is another challenge completed. Dude, Fernando was almost too good for that one. Our next cover athlete will be MLB 20's Javi Baez. Let's see what Javi Baez is gonna have to do here. Oh no, I've got to try and get a hit from the fisheye camera. Some of you might not think this is a challenge for me, but let me tell you, it is. I've played on the same camera angle for like six years. I am a strike zone merchant. I can't, I don't even recognize the pitch. Honestly, that first at bat could have been a lot worse. You know what? We got this. I believe, I have faith. Oh, I thought that was the one. Also, this pitcher's delivery is just not helping things. Okay, okay, I'm starting to see the pitch a little bit better. Oh, yes! You're not counting that as an error, right? Just making sure, yep, Baez grounded to right for a single. So that's a challenge completed. Hey man, this is a pretty good start. We're three for four. And now we move to the 19 cover boy, Bryce Harper. Honestly, the Harper cover was one of the more interesting MLB The Show covers. Get a triple, oh, come on. This challenge is gonna haunt me this whole video, isn't it? The thing about Harper is that he can easily find a gap but I'm pretty sure he only has like 76 speed on this card. Yo, no shot I like get this first try, right? Come on, Bryce, get on your horse. Wait. Did I really just get bailed like that? Harper tripled to center? Dude, if he threw it to third, I would have been out. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll take it. So that was kind of wild, but it's another challenge down. I did not expect to complete that one, let alone complete on the first attempt. But now we move to the MLB 18 cover boy, Aaron Judge. What is the challenge for Aaron Judge gonna be? 
bunt for a hit? Yeah, this seems like a fitting challenge for the dude that broke the AL home run record. You know what? Maybe this could actually work. I mean, the shift is on and nobody expects Judge to bunt when he's up at the plate. Come on, Judge. No, <laughs> he's not going to throw me a strike. There's just no chance. Bro, I probably look like such a tool doing this. <laughs> All right, take two. This time I have two guys on though. Judge, put the bat on the ball. I'm going to take another pitch right here. Oh, and of course it's a strike. <laughs> I just can't put the bat on the ball with Judge. With the shift on, I think my best bet is a push bunt to the right side. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought he had a chance. Well, that's a tough break for the AL home run king. That's a failed challenge, which means that is now two copies of MLB The Show 23 to give away. But now we move to our first legend of the video, the MLB 17 cover athlete, Ken Griffey Jr. What are we gonna have to do with Ken Griffey Jr.? This should be interesting. Ooh, I have to get a perfect, perfect hit. And yes, this does have to be a perfect, perfect hit. A perfect line out would mean nothing. No, 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 no. Gotta lock in here and swing at a good pitch. Oh, that was a good 3-1 slider, I can't lie. Come on, Griffey, just one perfect swing. I can't lay off the low stuff. I just failed miserably with Griffey. So yes, that is our third copy of MLB The Show to give away. Bro, I wasn't even close on any of those attempts. Now it's time to take it back to MLB 16 and use Josh Donaldson. Let's see what I gotta do with JD, man. I failed back-to-back -back challenges. I gotta get back at it. Hit an extra base hit. Okay, that's doable. I've been really hot and cold with this Donaldson card all year. So while this seems like a very doable challenge, I would not be shocked if I find a way to blow it. Ah, once again, I'm going after the low pitches. Got to swing at a better pitch this time. Oh, that's got to go. That's got to go, right? That's an extra base hit for Josh Donaldson. Doing it in style too. So Josh Donaldson secures another challenge completed. And now we jump to Miguel Cabrera from MLB The Show 14. I'd love to get extra base hit again, especially with Miguel Cabrera. Hit a home run. Okay. Hitting a home run with the best third baseman in the game does not seem that difficult. But there I go. The low slider keeps getting me. Come on, give me something in the zone. I cannot stop. Come on, Miggy. You're too good to not complete this. That's such a good pitch. Oh, my God. Oh, that's another failed challenge. Another giveaway for MLB 23. I just threw so hard with Miggy, dude. But now we're going to pick up MLB 13's cover athlete, Andrew McCutcheon. What am I at? Like four failed challenges i don't have a lot of wiggle room right here i have to power swing for a hit all right mccutcheon power swing time oh no don't be caught don't be caught no bro i am falling apart it would be so nice if i could face a lefty but i don't think it's gonna happen mccutcheon boom power swing hit i don't know how exactly to prove to you guys that i was using power swing but i was so we bounce back complete another challenge with andrew mccutcheon and we only have four cover athletes remaining and up next is adrian gonzalez from mlb 12. well let's see what the wheel wants me to try to do with adrian gonzalez oh 430 foot home run i mean that's definitely doable with his home run derby x card but with the way i've swung the bat the past couple challenges i'm i'm kind of nervous for this one. Oh, my opponent put us at coors field i couldn't ask for a better place to hit oh my guy still suck come on Aegon. you played so many years in the nl west you got to be comfortable hitting at coors field no no, that, that was it. That would have easily been 430. Ooh. And then he gets me looking. Oh my God. Who goes right back to the same pitch after somebody hits a 400 foot foul ball on it? At least we're still in a good hitter's ballpark for attempt number three. I want to get this so bad, bro. Oh, come on. No, no. Even if that leaves, that's not 430. Oh my God, man. I'm going to have nightmares about that foul ball at Coors.
Well, we failed Adrian Gonzalez's challenge, which of course means another giveaway. And it's gonna come down to the final three players to see if I'm giving away five extra copies of the game. So next up, we have Joe Maurer, the cover athlete of both MLB 11 and MLB 10. Come on, wheel. Don't give me anything crazy right here. Give me something doable. Get on base. Don't let me down, Joe Maurer. Dude, with his contact against a righty right here, Joe Maurer should have this in the bag. Yeah, I mean, that one was almost a layup for Joe Maurer. We'll go ahead and get an extra base hit just for good measure. So Joe Maurer steps up, completes a clutch challenge. So now we jump to Ryan Howard from MLB 08. Just nothing crazy right here. Okay, I'll take home run, double, any of that type of stuff. That's not what I'm looking for. I'm gonna have to get a hit holding my controller upside down. What, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go like... Wait, what? So this this thumb would be the PCI movement. Oh, this is this is not gonna work. Okay, so I move it. So I just gotta basically think of it as everything is inverted. If it's low, go up. I went the wrong way. Honestly, the best bet might just be to not even move the PCI. Hey, I made contact. That's a good first sign. All right, I think the play is kind of keeping the PCI hovering right here. Oh, don't hit me. Get down, ball. Get down. Give me a fluke. No, he dove. Oh, and now he's replaying it. Okay, dude. All right, last chance. Come on, just make a mistake over the middle. Whoa. Oh, two. This isn't good. That one's tough. Safe to say I failed that one. So this really is coming down to the wire. I've completed seven challenges. I've failed six. And it all comes down to the first ever MLB The Show cover athlete, David Ortiz. Safe to say I am terrified of what the wheel might give me right here. Hit an extra base hit with David Ortiz. We got to be able to get that done. This is it, man. It all comes down to Big Poppy. Oh no, oh, oh no. Come on, don't screw this up. Big Poppy, walk off. And for that being the final challenge, of course we're gonna replay it. Big Poppy steps up for me when I needed him most. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the eighth challenge completed, meaning I hit my goal. We finished with six total giveaways of MLB The Show 23. And as far as those five extras, hey, stay tuned. There might be more giveaways in the future. Remember, for the giveaways, make sure to follow my Twitter and my Instagram. I will be making the posts with information regarding these videos on Friday, February 3rd on both platforms. So drop a follow, keep an eye on them, and you'll have a chance to win a copy of the next MLB The Show game.